the bus is coming. Here comes the bus. <laughs> <laughs> what do I say? <laughs> and then we walk. Okay. Are you still video? <laughs> this is the engineering building. Rather than crying in the SDH, this is where we cry. The end. Beth and I were struggling with an assignment for a long time. And for the first time in two months, we reverted to our old ways and went right back to Chegg. And it feels so right. It feels so right. <laughs> no. <laughs> For your transforms, follow us everywhere. Oh. The only thing that makes it better is a giant mug of tea. <laughs> I'm sweeping the leaves. Psychographs <laughs> show nice endothelial coverage. Hello! We're skipping class and going to the National Gallery. We'll probably grab a few pints afterwards because Woo! why not? <laughs> so, Beth, what's your favorite part about Dublin? My favorite part about Dublin is coming back after a trip because it actually has been starting to feel like home and I really like that. So I guess that's all. What about, what's your favorite part about Dublin? My favorite part about Dublin is that you, Irish culture can be found in any pub. You just walk right in and it's there, there's music playing, there's Guinness to drink and yeah. you're in it. It's easy. Ooh, I want to talk about one of my favorite memories. Okay. Um, was when we went to the pub during the soccer match against Germany. And Germany won the Soccer World Cup last year. So people were like, oh my gosh, Germany's so good. And Ireland was definitely the underdog. And they won. And the whole pub stood up and cheered. Some guy hugged Ashling. Everyone spilled their beers all over the floor. And that was, uh, it was just a really good, a good time. Yeah. So, um, one of the great things about studying in Dublin is that you can just hop on a plane and go anywhere in Europe for very inexpensively. Um, so where have we been, Beth? Um, well, our first trip out of the country was in Edinburgh, Scotland. And I think that might have been my favorite, my favorite trip. It was awesome. Edinburgh, Amazing. awesome. So great. Um, and then after that... Where did we go? Oktoberfest. Oktoberfest. So we flew into Basel, Switzerland, stayed there for a little bit, took a train to Zurich, Switzerland, stayed there overnight, um, and then we went to Munich for Oktoberfest for the weekend, and we went camping there, which it was an experience. <laughs> we were young, we could manage, <laughs> but it was fun. It was not something, I wouldn't go camping again. At Oktoberfest. At Oktoberfest. <laughs> With a 20 euro tent. Yeah. Um, but it was it was really cool. Definitely once once in a lifetime. Yeah. Um, and then separately, Beth and I, on the same weekend, Beth and I were both in Paris, um, yeah. that, which is amazing. Everything in Paris lives up, lives up to expectations. Um, and then Beth was in London. Oh, yeah. I went to London for a day, and then I went to Athens for the weekend. Um, and I actually just got back yesterday, but there aren't direct flights from Dublin to Athens, so I had to fly out of London first. So I decided to make a day out of it while I was there, so um, I got to see all the sights there. And then Athens was absolutely gorgeous. I had to wear sunscreen. I got mosquito bites, but it was lovely. I got to see a sunset and a sunrise. A sunrise and a sunset in the same day, um, which was great. So it was, it was a good trip. Probably my second favorite so far. But And we still have more to go. Um, yeah. We are both going to Amsterdam and Brussels separately, but we're going to Barcelona together. Yes. And we're I'm going to Copenhagen. Are you going anywhere else? Um, I'm going to London and Paris again right before I leave. Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah. So, so yeah. Yeah. Um, having a great time over here but lots of traveling we definitely miss you guys and to these sisters coming abroad here you're gonna love it dublin's awesome great. live off campus definitely no live doubt. off campus specifically 11 stevens lane which yeah. three aoe alumni have already lived in so True. you'll be continuing the tradition mm -hmm. um so yeah good Thanks. to talk to you guys see you later, see you later. <laughs>